wasn't really raised with religion. And in a lot of ways, that's what this record seems to be symbolizing for me. Music as religion. Music as the thing that's carried me through the darkest chapters of my life. It's carried me through the brightest, highest highs of my life and everything in between. It's always been there for me. solo we loaded in on april 16th and first thing to do was get drum tones with dave and then during that time i had set up and i was jamming with them dave likes to jam with just me in the room probably because he's just used to it every time we demo it's like that and it's like we do that him and i are jamming a lot just him and me so that wrapped up put all the drum tracks together um, Dave came in. Dave doesn't play to a click, click a click track. We don't play to a click track. For the most part, fucking Dave McLean is on natural and fucking ripping it. Ripping it. The new badass Yamaha kit. Uh, Dave kind of suggested, well, let's just do a whole new kit. And I said, all right, let's do that. That would be awesome. And the way I found out how kick-ass they were was, uh, you know, I was with another drum company. We had both my, both my kits in the studio and we a b in them and uh, we borrowed a, a Yamaha kit from a uh, guitar center and we put it up nice. and it what it wasn't even it wasn't even like close it was it was just it was amazing like the the difference was just unbelievable so you know we took this kit out of the box last weekend put it up and you know we were going to try out my other two Yamaha kits that I have and this we didn't even try this is the one when Dave and I came here for the first time we both came in through the door and Dave walked in he was like this looks exactly like the room where Queen recorded Night at the Opera he's like this is awesome and I didn't know what the hell he was talking about but I just went with that I was like that's rad so got a cool vibe here it was kind of good that we, we you know Rob kind of came up with this timeline you know we got offered the Mayhem tour and He's like, I think April would probably be a good good time to get into the studio. And we were about five months away at that point and only a couple songs, but it was kind of, it was kind of cool having that and kind of lighting a fire under your ass to get going. And um, so it was cool, you know, and like always, just things kind of happen, you know. A lot of times things just happen at the very last week, you know, and, uh, and it went really good. And we got, you know, I feel like we've got this, this amazing record that that uh, gives me the same feeling as when we were doing Through the Ashes and when we were doing the Blacking. It, it just feels it feels good. It's from it's completely from our hearts, you know. And it's like awesome. Just it's metal. That's all you can say about it. it's metal. <laughs> 